I don't know what happens if you give a mouse a cookie. I didn't have that book growing up. I had its two spin-offs. If you give a moose a muffin, and if you give a pig a pancake. But as someone who owns three mice, I have no idea what happens if you give them cookies. But I do have a chance to find out. Kind of. Today, I'll be finding out what happens if you make a mouse a birthday cake. Whitby is one year old. This is not Whitby. I don't think Whitby likes being on camera or being held particularly. So this is our stand-in Whitby for you to look at. Now, for mice, turning one is like turning 40. It's a pretty huge deal. Turning one for humans is not as big of a deal as people lead you to think it is. All it is is the first year you're alive. You can go goo goo gaga, mama dada, um, you drink milk, you maybe eat a few solid foods. Do you walk yet? I don't actually know what one-year-olds do. I think they walk, they, they crawl, they do something. Um, but being a mouse and being 40, being one, it's a big deal. You should have a job, you should have a family, you should maybe, maybe planning for retirement. Just kidding, you're never getting to retire. But Whitby? Whitby's kind of a freeloader. Whitby has no job, he just lives in my room for free. I, I pay him to live here, I buy him so much stuff. I bake him cakes, he doesn't give me shit. Uh, he doesn't have a family, which is kind of okay with me because I don't want more mice and I don't think the girls would like him very much. They seem pretty happy in their little colony over there. All, all this being said, he deserves a cake. Just look at him. He's, he's such a good boy. He deserves a small cake, because if your mouse does look like him, he's a, he's a little- I know you're trying. He's a little on the big side. Uh, he, he's a big- he's a big boy. Don't worry about it. I know you're- I know you're doing your best if your mouse looks like that because holy shit, you can't make them exercise, you can't put a mouse- I mean, you can put them on a diet, but you can't make them do anything. What is he gonna do? For this cake, all you're gonna need is yogurt, millet, food, treats. Whatever food, whatever treats you give your mouse, anything will work. Any yogurt from the fridge, um, flavorless organic just things that you would put in your body just kidding that's a bad standard i don't trust what you guys put in your bodies all you're gonna do is mix all this shit up in the teeniest tiniest bowl you can find freeze it for maybe an hour uh put some love into it or a literal little heart 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 treat um put it on the teeniest most tiniest table you own everybody owns a tiny table i'm sure if you don't all right, and serve it up. Your mouse will love it. And now all that's left to do is enjoy Whitby's enjoyment. And I'll enjoy it too. That's three of us enjoying this all at the same time, which is a pretty good number. It's about the number of years that Whitby's gonna live. Total.
I'm not done with you. It's time for the advice segment. This is a unique advice segment because I don't have anything for you, but you might have something for me. I'm going to complain at you and you're going to give me answers. Now, the complaint stems from something you may have noticed. The rest of this video is shot very nicely on a pretty cool little camera um, that scares me. This is on my phone because it's kind and familiar and I know it. I see it every day. I see it a bit too often. It's like a family friend, almost. Uh, camera? I love to take pictures. I love to shoot video. I don't like to look into the barrel. It's like looking at a gun. This phone is like a hug. My camera is like a gun. I've had it for a year and I, I would love to do more stuff like this where I'm just talking at it, but it's so intimidating. It's a beast. I don't know if it's just too big. How, how, realistically, most of the people watching this video are people that I know personally, so shoot me a DM. Tell me, what the, how do I, how do I make peace with the beast? Or how do I get another camera that's small and kind upon my eyes? Because I kind of want a new camera. But it's been a year, don't, this is for me, this is advice for me. Do not get a new camera. You don't need one. You don't need a new camera. Please. All right, anyway, you're fine. You're free, free to go. Thank you for your time. Goodbye.